Let's go in live. Take it away, Jahar. All right, we got Cypher here sitting in the uh, upper echelon of, of the bracket. We've got Rockets and not a whole lot else. He's actually not grabbing much. Uh, Necro's managed to get away with just about everything. Cypher is having to trail behind him, picking up the pieces, going, all right, can I please have a, a rail now? Can I please have a rocket? All right, cool. So Cypher's not even looking at the red. Necro's got literally everything except information on where Cypher's sitting. But these item pickups are going to be heard by Necro for sure. And Cypher's is looking for that first hit, but it's going to need to be the first of many at this rate. Pretty quiet start to the map. Neither player going super aggressive. Cypher, uh, Necro rather, more than happy to keep high ground control. Cypher playing sneaky sneaky. Oh, well, it, it somehow turned him Necro mega, knew exactly where he was. It turned him mega, it turned him armor, so at least, you know, compared to the first 30 seconds, the stacks are more even. And especially with rails like that. Oh, but death from above, Necro out of nowhere. But Cypher's rockets are just as good. The damage could not be more even, but it's going to be Necro taking the first frag. Just barely. He's going to need that 50. He's going to need the yellow. He's going to need to get back over towards Mega pronto. But he spots Cypher mid-map. That gives him a little bit of time to react and get ready here. Not going up the jump pad. He's kind of giving that Mega over to Cypher, but taking a bit of damage off of him. He missed the gimme shot, though. That's going to be rough because it means that Cypher can indeed push in on this red armor, but it's not going to happen. And can I just say, my take on this match here is if Necro can keep his cool and play to the best of his abilities, I think he's got this. And this is against Cypher, of course, a literal legend of the Quake genre. Uh, but Necro has looked so strong, um, and he just has a deep understanding of how this game works. Especially with these weebs coming out, making good use of them all the time. Mega back in Necro's hands. Cypher getting a, a few fives. But Necro's keeping the high ground, hoping for that first rocket. We actually hear... Maybe I hear it correctly. My hearing's been off, but... <laughs> you hear him going back up towards that Mega, and, and Necro takes a slim advantage of that, but there's not a whole lot for Cypher to get over that side, so... He's breaking out more towards Red. He gets the pickup. Only 30 damage off that rocket. Disappointed. <laughs> Kind of interesting to see how a lot of the players in this tournament have been using the blaster at long range in surprising situations. Ooh, Ooh. that that was that was a move. It was <laughs> Necro's trying to get out of dodge. Yeah, well. There's the rocket oh, pop, but where's the follow-up? And it doesn't even give him the red armor. Cypher ties it back up, taking the armor, still with plenty of that mega left over. Which means this mega's gonna be, yeah, rough going. Yeah. That wasn't the place to be. I'm trying to figure out which map has the trolliest yellow armor. <laughs> the one that just baits you out and it's yeah, just, no kidding. you shouldn't have done it. Just why in a lot of these maps, like, blue armor ends up being, you know, the, the, the calmer but safer choice. But good LG coming out of Cypher. Sexy LG. Very strong, very strong, and we should expect it at this point. It's Cypher after all. these rails coming out. Yeah, that's trouble. Oh, no. Right here in Diabotical. It's going to be <laughs> four up on one. That Cypher's looking incredibly confident. Checking the yellow armor, not for the armor itself, but, you know, to see if Necro's snooping around it. But these rockets coming in at a Necro. Where did that midair go? Oh, no! Don't kill I yourself! Don't no! No! I could have the rocket pass straight through him. Good job, this Cypher! Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's just cruel, Why man. Why can't it be like that? <laughs> That's one way to get, yeah, hammered in the face. I mean, you did damage Good with job. it. Good job. Good job. Great job. <laughs> All right, but Cypher take, takes away the Mega. And a chunk of Necro's self-esteem. Necro said that you were his idol. <laughs> You're my hero. <laughs> my hero no just longer. berated me in a final. <laughs> Uh, friendship with, with Cypher ended. <laughs> Bottle only friend now. Alright, so Cypher. Staying defensive on the red. Hopefully Necro's got a good way to shred that red. But Cypher's going, just waltzing back up to the Mega. Just like taking a sweet time. And having no opposition whatsoever. 
Oof. Yeah, Scyther. Stacked to the teeth here. Uh, Necro, no slouch at this point. Still with an okay stack. It's really going to come down to this next Mega to see who can eke out the, the major advantage across the map. And it's going to be a fight in the middle. I don't know if Necro realizes how big of a disadvantage he actually is in here. <laughs> About 100 less HP and armor put together. What was that, Cypher? <laughs> he had the angle, he had the pixel set up, and he actually had the opportunity for the shot, but he had rockets out instead of rails. Okay. Click. Oh, wait, no. Switch, then click. Oh, too late. All right. But plenty of rockets coming out of Cypher. No problemo. And every time and, Cypher uh, walks into yellow, he's, like, ready for a fight. He's like, he's going to be here. He's going to want LG. He's going to want yellow. Not going to give it to him. I'm not sure why Necro is fighting in a situation like that. I'm mean, sure it actually paid off for him there, but extremely risky stuff. Ugh. Yeah, right in the see. dome. I guess actually, <laughs> it's just a dome. It's only a dome, but yeah, it's the dome, dome has been hit by a rocket. There's the angle. He actually had the weapon out this time. So yeah, Cypher's not looking bothered one bit. And honestly, Great like, rocket, if Necro though. can get some more of these rockets out and, uh, and not kill himself while doing it, then that'll be helpful. Yeah, Necro is trying to play the sneaky game, try to look for these big direct rockets. It just hasn't been working out. He hasn't been able to catch Cypher unaware. Oh, that's some huge catching. LG coming Nothing out of Necro. Hands. <laughs> Maybe Cypher's wow. depth perception is not quite there. I think if Cypher just even had his LG out at all, that would have been a kill for him. Yeah, absolutely. But. But Necro's happy to have the one. He's going to take the one frag he has and cherish it and feed it and pet it. Until he loses it to Cypher again. Cypher's already got armor. And uh, great balls of fire coming out of that rocket shop. It's going to be... Oh, I thought it was going to be a mutual frag even. But nope. Cypher gets out of it with 11 HP. Has to be Necro careful just going needs to find Cypher and it's a sure frag. Ooh, 2 HP. Two. Steals away the red armor, but... Doesn't this should be a frag. Order. Yeah, you could hear like the, the rocket spam like, all right, he's going to come through the teleporter, right? No, no, he's not. Down to 5 HP, takes the 50, and Necro's still oh, no. going to die here. Not like Necro's this. Necro's still going to die not... here. <laughs> I, oh. I want to suck your health. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. All right. The, the last Super rocket close, was going to connect, but now Necro's got a red armor as well. Comeback time. Oh, Seven perfect, frags. Perfect. Let's go. Back through the teleporter, and again, back into the railgun. Like, why? Maybe don't go that way. It's a bad place to go. You go there, and then you can't go anywhere else. Okay, so Necro has a fighting chance here. Just two minutes left on the clock. Oh, uh, Necro has to pull <laughs> it's out, otherwise it's done. <laughs> this is Rocket Arena all of a sudden. Kill. Holy shit. Or midair. I hope... Weed is saying so stuff like uh, King of Bongo or something lame like that. <laughs> what? That was voice clips from Warsaw Midair. Old, old oh. person stuff. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I didn't play enough Warsaw. <laughs> Nobody did. <laughs> Necro actually played a fair amount. So, see, you see what it gets you. Oh, that was almost denial, but now he's only got the one rocket. This is like where you want to be with a rocket fight, and he doesn't have any ammo. There we go. He's got the pickup. A little bit of ammo. By the way, these ammo pickups are, are so adorable. Definitely a favorite. All right, but we're almost into golden frag okay. territory. Three to nine. Hector's like, how does it feel when I spam you at yellow? No big deal for Cypher. He just needs to not die for another 40 seconds. And then he just needs to make the one frag. It's that simple. Yeah, a huge mountain to climb here still for Necro. Even though he has a stack advantage, it just feels like Cypher has enough chances left to collect that golden frag. This is not the fight you want. Like, Necro is so desperate to make this frag. But he's like 100-100. Cypher doesn't have any armor. If he can fight this red armor... Then, even if it goes to Golden Frag, which it's about to, he can slow things down and maybe start to get his own run back. Golden Frag. 
Like, it, it wouldn't have done him any good to, like, force that fight on the off chance that he adds another 20 seconds to the clock. Not if it means giving up this stack. So, right now, especially with this ping, like, yeah, long range all the way. But these rockets are so frustrating. He's feeling it. Oh, well, there's the smash. There's the hit. But not the frag. That will be Cypher taking the first map in this best of three. And remember, people, Cypher's in the winner's bracket here. Yes. So, Cypher only needs to win two maps in this winner's bracket finals to take the victory. On the other hand, the young upstart, I don't know if he's young, but he's an upstart to me at least, Necro, has to win <laughs> two best of threes coming from the uh, loser's bracket. All right. Are we switching servers? Oh, wrong map, okay. Derp, derp, derp. By the way, I really do love the, the armor break Frontier. animation. A lot of the art is just, yeah, it's nice. It's just right. It's exactly what I needed. So kudos. Indeed. All right. So match and tournament point for Cypher. Yep. This is a slower map. Is one where Necro can work his his Game rocket magic if things three, go well, but GLs two, and HFs one, thrown out. Here we go. Right. No, no GLs, only HFs. <laughs> All right, but Cipher again. He loves the blue armor. It's a it's an atrium he feels comfortable in, I suppose. But again, a late play to the LG means for one he doesn't pick it up. For two, he's in a, a tough spot. But these rockets coming out of him are just flawless. Here comes the red armor and Cypher in a great position. And now, <laughs> Necro. Oh. Uh, I don't know about this play. Oh, oh coming close. <clears throat> but still overly aggressive. And this is going to give Cypher really easy reign over both the yellow and the mega to boot. So now, Necro on the back foot. Not a great way to start out this map, especially given that the tournament is on the line. Absolutely. Cypher having a, ooh, a little bit of a trap laid by Necro on the red. Does he have anything else to, to go with that blaster? Not so much. If he had crossbow, if he had rockets, that would have been one thing. But now he's uh, just now getting to the yellow armor. He was waiting for it oh, no. and punished for his mistiming. Necro right, is just going go. super there's, aggressive. There's the messy frag we needed. What, what's he saying? Makes sense. Yeah, <laughs> Don't worry about it. Just uh, get close and, and hug Rocket. Oh my god. No, no! What happened there? What was that? Oh. <laughs> well, it doesn't. <laughs> oh, that was such a gimme for Necro, really. Like, that was gonna be. <laughs> Game needs work. Beta, beta, beta. Very first turn. Yeah, it's a beta. Ever. Come on, guys. Play. Yeah. <laughs> you need oh, some work on your game. Oh. Cypher, yo! <laughs> Uh, <laughs> this, guy, uh, this trash talk chill. is just like perfect, subtle, but on point. <laughs> I, I do have to agree with Cypher, though. We know it's a beta. We know it needs work. We're doing this yeah. as a beta tournament. That's the it point. Is. It's a beta for what it looks like to host a dual tournament. Which is so why Necro... you invited all the betas. <laughs> <laughs> I've, been, I've been rooting for you, Necro. Don't make me change my mind. <laughs> But seriously, that fight should have been Necro's. I, I don't know. I'm not sure what happened, but you get the initial rocket pop on the jump pad, and, and that should be locked. Cypher's just going for the bow to finish off. Necro's so weak, but he's taking the blue armor. The armors are actually not that crazy compared to other quakes. It's like 50, 75, and 100. So, like, the difference between red and, and blue is yeah. as much as the difference in, like, quake live between red and yellow. So, armor's a little right. bit uh, of an easier thing here. Cypher just doesn't care, I, I think. He's just, yeah, I'm going to hit you eventually. But this is one way to get somebody to go full tilt. And I think he knows it. Playing with his food. You can just see it in the gameplay from, from Necro. Oh, yeah. He's not his usual calm and collected self right now. And unfortunately for him, this is how he played against Cypher the first time as well. 
feels like lag and ping are really starting to weigh on these players a little bit. And believe us, we hear you, players. Next time oh, yeah. we do this, it's going to be region logged. Don't you worry. <laughs> but we're trying to make the best of this here. Yeah, we're on, we're on serious coronavirus quarantine, so no more, no more mixing here. Oh my god. This LG coming back in with the hammer. Oh, he wanted it. <laughs> Eight to one. Okay. All right. Okay, Necro. Sure. Make it happen. You kind of go ham and, and go stupid until you make a frag, and then you're like, maybe I am taking this seriously. He didn't take the 50, though. He wants to make it back to the yellow in time. But he's a little bit early for this mega. I don't think... Yeah, actually, he can challenge. Oh, my gosh. Uh, not anymore. Those rocket bounces were unfortunate. I want to know who made this map and what they were thinking when they put that little crossbeam right there. Like, yeah, perfect. Perfect. <laughs> this is what this needs. All right, but halfway through, if, if we continue at this current pace. And Necro's starting to put some hits together. Yeah, I'm cool. liking what I'm seeing. That opener that with the crossbow. Crossbow, though. though. It's not fun. Trying to go for it. Try, he tries to get the oh. quick switch, which might have done it. I think Cypher was, what, at 85? So not quite. Necro wants a bow, too. Honestly, go for the hammer. Just, yeah, hammer up. Yeah, there we go. There we go. I like the completely non-functional shield, too, just to give it a little bit of extra visual kick. Yeah. What did we do to deserve a quick game with personality? When did that happen? Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> we don't deserve, James. We don't. <laughs> well, we got him anyway. <laughs> All right, but nine to two. This is not the upper bracket final, not by a long shot. Oof. I think it's this play. I mean, Necro has to make it happen here. Yeah. He's down so much already. He can't afford to go down any One further. One rail will do it. Only One rail will do it. Oh, left on the, the armor. Clock. Yeah. He drops and he's not looking the right way. He's going down for the Mega. The mega's not there. Please tell me he's not waiting for the Mega. Please don't be down there when, when Cypher comes around the corner. Oh, he's not approaching it, though. He's just going right back over to red. Huh. All right, Mega. He will. He'll be able to pick it up in the end. And now Necro actually has the best stack we've seen in some time. Except for those bolts are coming straight out from. Oh man, that's got to be frustrating. If you're Necro right now, he's getting pummeled. Absolutely pummeled by the crossbow. Cipher has been hitting shot after shot, and it's exactly at the wrong time for Necro. And he used that dash just to like dodge a little bit, but it's putting him in a weird place. Cipher hears the pain. What? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, and, and Necro's not Dude. playing around at all. Oh! <laughs> Necro survives it. Catches Cypher on the spawn at the LG. Is the LG going to take Necro down? No, it's Wait not. Wait a minute. What is happening? Wait a minute. We have Necro a game. Taking the red. He, he can't catch Cypher on another spawn. Coming back here to the blue armor is a good spot because, yep, Cypher always comes in the blue armor. Next time you run into Cypher at a dark alley, just know. He goes to the blue armor. Nice rocket. Needs a little bit of a follow-up. He's at 69 health, though. This isn't worth it. No reward is worth this. And he has to let Cypher go, unfortunately. I feel like if this was the Necro we were seeing during the duration of this entire series, the result would be completely different. Sneaky. Well, it comes down to a couple spawn frags, so he's about to make this one here. Big question is, where's Cypher going to spawn? He's not going for the yellow. Blue, maybe. Like, don't, don't, what, what are you doing waiting for five health? Go, 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 go to blue. <laughs> five health. All right, so here comes red, and Cypher's not there either. Cypher got away with yellow armor and mega. If that's not just, like, blue plus a lot of shards. He needs an initial hit. Necro's not getting it. Four frags to pick up. 
I want to believe. Question is, does Necro believe? All right, Mega's popping. Cypher's not there to do anything about it. So Cypher's... They're, they're both going to have lots of armor, lots of health, lots of what the fuck is happening <laughs> with these rockets. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, <laughs> that hurt to watch. That was physically painful. <laughs> How could something that was so right go so wrong? All right, Jahar's going up the deep end, people. <laughs> so not. I think that's that's Necro. But yeah, rocket spam here. That's the ticket. Nice rail co or bow coming out of Cipher. Look for the finisher. Six, Six HP. HP. Made it. No. <laughs> Twenty seconds from Golden Frag. This tournament could be over in just a couple to golden moments. Frag. Yeah. Cypher tastes victory. He tastes that $750 prize pool. Golden frag. It's golden frag time, but Necro somehow comes out with the kill there. He's still alive. There's still time. Oh. No, there's not. Cypher will take the grand final. Take the first place prize and take Necro down. That and that's it. Is a diabolical dual cup, everybody. That's what that is.